Well, this past Wednesday was the season finale for Meyer Family's 10th season. And this fall, it will be the 11th and final season of Meyer Family. Yep, so they're going into their 11th season by September later this year. For the Meyer Family season 10 season finale, it was a good episode. I enjoyed it. It was very, very funny. They were just showing flashbacks of all the family members pretty much having their birthday experiences. Um, it started off with Phil, where he turned 50, and he vowed that next year, when he turned 51, he was going to learn how to play the piano and learn how to uh, speak Spanish. It also led to Haley's pregnancy. And I had a feeling that the season finale was going to be where Haley finally has her twins, Cameron and Mitchell were the first ones to find out that Haley was pregnant. Haley told them to make sure that they don't tell Claire because Claire obviously would not be happy about it. Now, Mitchell told her, hey, your secret's safe with me, no worries. But he's worried more about Cameron because Cameron is known to not be good at uh, keeping secrets. So he was just being real with Haley. But Haley was dead serious. She grabbed him by his shirt, looked him into the eyes, and told him, hey, you better not tell Claire. I am dead serious. So he promised he, uh, he wouldn't. Also, Manny, who had a girlfriend, the one with the blonde hair, uh, Manny asked her hand in marriage. And she was shocked, and she said that no, she would not marry Manny. I guess it just came out of nowhere. I guess she didn't expect Manny to ask her hand in marriage like it was too soon. So she said, no, Manny, I'm, I'm sorry. Why would you even think that? And then she just ran. She just ran out the house and that's it. Like, I don't know. Did she ever apologize to Manny? I mean, she just left. Like, damn, the dude just asked your hand in marriage. I mean, if you feel like you're not ready, that's fine. But... Why'd you have to leave the house without no explanation four days after that happened? Apparently, Manny and her were no longer boyfriend and girlfriend. And Manny was hurt. He was devastated. He was crying. I feel bad for him. I mean, even after four days, he was still hurt, even when it was Lily's birthday. And he brought down the whole family. And I'm sure it wasn't Manny's intent. But I don't know. Maybe he shouldn't show up for the birthday party. I mean, I know obviously he had to support because, you know, him and Lily are family or whatnot, but still. So Gloria suggests Jay go over there and try to make Manny feel better. All Jay said was, cheer up, buddy. It was four days ago. That's it. <laughs> That's it. Jay did his job. He was pretty much telling Manny, let it go. <laughs> and obviously Lily wasn't happy about it. You know, Lily's like, this is her birthday party. The attention should be on her, not Manny. So when she was about to blow out the candles, Manny just quickly grabbed a cake and goes, I wish I was dead. And he blew out the candles. What the hell? Poor Manny. So then when it was Cameron's birthday, Haley felt that she go ahead and reveal that Cameron and Mitchell were the first ones to find out. So Cameron, he kept his secret, but Claire was obviously not happy. She was really upset with Mitchell. She felt like Mitchell could come to her and tell her anything. They would tell each other things as a brother and sister. So then Lily got upset as she brought up the whole what happened at her birthday party because she could understand Cameron's pain. And she was like, yeah, now you know how I feel when whiny Manny was crying about his breakup with his girlfriend. So then Lily messed that up and uh, it, it caused Manny to think about what happened. And then he said that she's moved on now. She's got a boyfriend now. And she does like commercials that Manny has to deal with seeing. And then he ran off. Damn, Lily. <laughs> Manny was doing just fine until you had to bring that up. I understand you heard about what happened with your birthday, but you should have let that pass. But no, she caused Manny to think about his ex-girlfriend again and he started running off crying what the hell lily <laughs> so leading up to Haley's pregnancy Haley's water broke when uh, the family were supporting phil to play the piano and they had to leave because it was time for Haley to have her twins and phil he was impressive he played the piano real fast to catch up with his family i mean he literally broke it down he was amazing
So they get to the hospital. Haley has her twins. And Cameron and Mitchell brought in the twins for the whole family to see. One twin is a boy. One twin is a girl. And they brought them in Lion King style. They did the whole circle of life. And <laughs> it was pretty funny. I think Claire has warmed up to Dylan. I think she's starting to like Dylan. They showed one part where they're holding one of the twins and she gave Dylan a kiss on the cheek. So it was it was um it was nice. It was a very wonderful season finale. Now it's time for this final season coming in in the fall.